Can we talk a little bit? 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 About the Salili Bembry New Balance's 991 V2s, please. Yes, we can. So, I'm a big fan of these. I'm a bigger fan of these than I was of the yellow pair. I'm not sure if the yellow pair was the same. I think the yellow pair was the same model that he recently gave away somewhere. I think in Scandinavia. Maybe it was Copenhagen. Maybe it was Denmark. No, maybe it was Copenhagen. Maybe it was Stockholm. I don't know. Somewhere in Copenhagen, he gave away some free pairs. Fucking amazing. I'm sure there were some people from London who flew over there to go get some because the flights usually in Scandin to Scandinavia from London are pretty cheap. So if you were smart, you probably could have flew to fucking London from to there, got queued up, got your free pair and come back. Um, for the price of a pair essentially if you wanted to you could do that in a day if need be but i think the purple pair here that he's teased are so fucking lush they're so fucking amazing i cannot wait for them to drop there's no idea on the actual drop date release if i'm scanning quickly here we've got 250 as a price point but no actual day on release but they look so beautiful and you know me, I'm a big stickler for suede. I love a good hairy suede. I love a good soft, soft suede. I love a mixture of fucking mesh. And with this particular model, they look incredible. Especially the picture from the top down. I think these are usually an un, um, an underrated picture angle for sneakers. I feel like a lot of sneakers will look bets, will look good on like the side profile. Most sneakers are not going to look shit. But I think day to day when you're wearing them, the, the angle that you, you see mostly is from the top down. And when your shoes look like this from the top down, you know you're in for a good time. So you've got this combination of purples on the upper. You've got a nice light kind of purple hairy suede, I guess, on the most of the mud guard and some of the middle unit. You have a put of a more of a darker purple here on this mesh toe box. You have these um 3M panels here flanking the toe box. You have this really nice kit which looks like a, is it, I think it's like a teal colorway on the inside lining here, which is a pretty nice pop. And then you also got the purple laces. I'm assuming in a pack or in the box, there's probably going to be other color laces. You might probably get the, the that teal colorway. You might get this little bit of yellow hit right here on the toe box. Sorry, right here on the kind of, you know, on the lip that kind of comes up on the front of the toe box. Those might be actually the ones that you might actually get in the box itself to kind of mix up a little bit. And then on the, on the actual label on the tongue, you actually got Silly Bembry written here and you got New Balance 9 and 1 V2s on there as well. And you'll see how soft and lush that suede is. So I can't wait for these to drop. No ideas on no idea on when they're gonna drop. But I guess if Silly Bembry's teasing them now, I'm assuming the drop is very soon, especially since we've seen those yellow ones that everybody was going crazy for. But I particularly have my eyes on these more. The yellow ones are still nice, don't get me wrong. But I think for my, you know, for my general outfits and shit considering what i've currently gotten at the moment i think these purple ones would be definitely definitely up my fucking street um let's actually read the blurb here a little bit it says lee Bembry has just taken instagram to reveal that his next collaborator to grace the 991 v2s teasing a pair at copenhagen fashion week where he gave away three pairs of his up-and-coming collaboration with a five three okay it's a five three zero okay really i thought i thought that was a i thought that was a new the, the same model so they're saying that yellow model was a 530. Are they sure? Are they sure about that? From there, royal blue appears on the tongue. Additional pops of color are delivered with green lining and off-white on the midsole. At the time of writing, neither New Balance or City Bembry have shared any details regarding the up-and-coming collaboration involving the 991 V2s. So let's see. I didn't know those yellow ones were like 530s. I thought they were... Oh, they were 530s. I honestly thought they were fucking um, the ones that he originally had. Oh, the ones here, the 992s, the 991 V2, sorry. I didn't know they were 550s, okay. My bad, my biddy biddy bad. But they're, they're decent enough, the yellow ones, but I'm just not the biggest fan of them, personally, myself. Um, as good as they are, I think colorway-wise, they obviously smashed it. He obviously does very, very well when it comes to the colorways. That's always something that he kind of champions, but I do prefer the 999, the 991 V2s. But that's the yellow pair that he gave away during Copenhagen Fashion Week. They look pretty decent. They look pretty lush. They're probably more of a Copenhagen shoe anyway. I'm sure they've been inspired by the local terrain out there. Maybe that's why he probably launched them over there. I actually would like to find out actually what that launch was all about. Why launch them at Copenhagen Fashion Week of all fashion weeks? Maybe to do something different because everyone goes to Paris Fashion Week to do those type of things. But they do look fucking good. Like he's a really good um, at doing these colorway shits. Like him and Teddy Santos are doing some bits over there at New Balance. But I want those purple joints. I want those purple joints. So when they be dropping, Mia Fia checking. So big up him, big up him. 